Hello Pisces, thank you for clicking on my channel. Welcome to the journey home. My name is Catherine and I live in Nova Scotia. This is your Zodiac Tarot forecast for the week ahead whenever you clicked on the title at the time it intrigued you. And just to let you know, I go live every Wednesday and Sunday night. If you would like to interact, I would love to pull some free cards for you. Everything you need to know about the website and channel is in the description below. We also have gift set giveaways, gemstone giveaways, lots of fun at the live readings. We're going to start with uh, the message from your guides, guardians, angels, and ancestors. And this one, I have never quite come across anything that looked so complicated but we're going to try to get through this this is the most important part of the message helps us to understand why these cards came up the way they did starting with your first card which is lightning and it's the forces of the upper world that are investing gathering energies to ignite you with new inspiration, creativity, illumination. Allow this gift of awakening to take root in your being and enjoy a renewed sense of clarity, passion, and vision. Now, the witness shows up to let us know, or to let you know, Pisces, that something that you have done has not gone unnoticed. And on your behalf, this witness comes forward in order to bring some blessings to you. This is a witness that's been by your side all along, but ready to become your ally. You thought you were the doer, but today you will discover that things happen when you get out of the way. Witness creation unfolding before you. Change reality by finding stillness and letting your true intent reveal itself. Something is being gifted to you, Pisces. At the heart of this spread, we have the Rainmaker, which is all these blessings that are raining down on you. But the wind, I think the witness is telling you to stay still through this downpour of blessings that's coming to you. Because it may feel a little chaotic. Because when the spirit of the wind comes calling, it's, it's the sign of change. Perhaps you need to change your mind about something. Or an old way of doing things has become automatic. Now you've gained some greater clarity through this illumination and these blessings. That you can make a new choice. Regardless of, how, of what the change is, you can expect to be understood. I have clear communication with others at this time. Ideas are solid and the shift that is being called for is in the highest good of all. And finally, your counsel that is surrounding you. This is the ones that you uh, had with you before you came to this earth and who will review your life when you leave this earth. This is reassurance that what is coming, these blessings, this illumination, is changing you changing you and we have transformation down here so you're going through some transformation we have you here at the crossroads but you're about to go into this ascension if you haven't begun already this is about rewards recognition victory and love and this is coming towards you quickly that's why I think the the wind, the rainmaker, the lightning is here. This is energy that's coming in very fast. You may intuitively know this, Pisces, but right at the heart of your reading is your destiny card. Your path. Communications are going to be moving, uh, opening up for you, maybe moving through you. Maybe these communications have to do with your counsel and the witness who is stepping forward as your ally. Something very meaningful taking place here, the Hierophant. This could be in the ending of a karmic cycle, the beginning of karmic rewards, but it, it seems to be happening now. At the time of this reading, expect it. I, I would almost wager to say something is going to happen at the end of the day, if not this week for you, that is going to open up doors, 
of abundance, blessings, opportunities. We have a soulmate card at the crossroads. So you are making a decision when it comes to a mate or someone is making a decision regarding you. But this is about spiritual union. This is a good card to get soulmate, the soulmate card and truth. So we have a balance coming in for you. This recognition, and I think this is the recognition of your, your guides, though this can be recognition reward on a, a 3D plane in, on the earthly realm, speaking your truth, becoming truth, and recognizing what is the truth. Chariot, fast energy moving forward, we have the waiting game. So uh, to me, this is like the waiting game is ending. Whatever it is you've been waiting on, Pisces is about to end. Uh, I should note, we see Libra energy, Cancer energy, Virgo, Gemini, Scorpio, and now we Temperance. Did I say Pisces? Temperance, Sagittarius energy, Patience, making the impossible possible, finding the gold at the end of the rainbow you're intuitively knowing sacrifice this is your card pisces this is the pisces card landing on the wheel of fortune your destiny your path traditionally the the uh, this is a hangman where the universe has put you on in hangman position to help you see things from a different perspective. Fertility, communications opening up to new ideas, birthing something new in your life. This could be uh, about brainstorming, developing a project with someone else. Maybe you get really busy with communications regarding business or in love. They could be Cupid's arrows as well. Transformation is being clarified by wisdom. This is the same card as the Hierophant. So you may, for some of you Pisces, this is about finding something very meaningful in a relationship with a Scorpio. For others of you, it is your ascending. It's, it's showing your ascending, even if you are involved with a Scorpio, showing this ascension that you're going through. Knowledge becomes wisdom. Wisdom is knowledge through experience. The Hierophant, something more meaningful. You're making movement here through choices and decisions. And the Magician brings you financial and material changes. You are going through some type of shift, some type of change. And it may even feel a wee bit uncomfortable for you, Pisces, but this is putting you back on your path. You're being allied with the forces of the universe. And you have abundance coming towards you. Let's end this reading with a message for love. This felt more like a career. Though we do see the soulmate card here at the crossroads. Could be that a decision that you're making regarding money. Or regarding the steps that you're taking on your path. Of reflects or is affects the soulmate regardless of what you decide at the crossroads pisces that card only shows up when you're making the right decision so let's ask for a message about love for pisces forgiving and learning as you release and heal the past you experience more love in your present moments Extend your lighthearted energy to others. Flirt. This almost feels Pisces like rather than get into some serious pain of the past, talking about it, it's time for you to release it. Or if someone is in your presence or in your environment where it's a bit heavy, bring some lighthearted energy into the situation. 
love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. This is the time for self-nurturing for you, Pisces. You're going through a shift. But you have romantic feelings and these feelings are real and they are worth exploring. Looks like you're on the right track, Pisces. I don't see any warnings here for you. Other than to be patient a little longer. If you're in a, a waiting game, this waiting game came up in the on the flip side for me when I pulled it because it's now clarifying the chariot, the wait ending. And once this wait ends, it's going to move very quickly forward for you, either in love, career, or both. If that resonated for you at all, Pisces, please do hit the like, share, subscribe. Join us at the live shows if you would like to interact and have me pull some free cards for you. Wednesdays and Sundays, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And check out everything you need to know about the website and channel in the description below this video. God bless you, Pisces. I hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye for now.